Hello everyone and welcome to another Town Hall 10 episode of this time we're gonna see how to attack Town Hall 10s with level 1 Inferno so we're gonna learn a couple of things from this attack this attack is gonna be on Blaster Zone as well and this is gonna enable you zooming in and out inside the video so definitely check the description under the video for the link so the first thing that we're going to learn is how to funnel the walking queen one of the ways to do that is dropping minions or wizards it depends on the defenses that are protecting the buildings on this one notice that he drops a couple of minions on some dead buildings and this is gonna enable and this is gonna make sure that the queen is not gonna go in this direction because this building is very very far and she's gonna go directly into this route and the reason for it is because he wanna destroy the queen which is gonna jump into this compartment so his main goal is getting into this compartment with the kill squad the second thing that we're going to learn and this is gonna work against level 1 inferno's only and only if you get max lightning spells and max earthquake spells so make sure that you're upgrading them and this is gonna make your chances of 3 star in those bases much much higher you can destroy level 1 inferno's with spells only if you're dropping two lightning spells and one earthquake spell or three lightning spells you're gonna destroy a level one inferno and that's exactly what he's going to do with the earthquake spell on this one and with three lightning spells on this one so we're gonna run the attack meanwhile and see how that happens so notice that the minions are gonna destroy those buildings and are gonna make sure that the queen is not gonna go anywhere he doesn't want you notice that the lightning spell and the earthquake spells were dropped on the inferno towers and easily destroy them and soon we're gonna see the third thing that i want to teach you guys so i can start meanwhile talking about it and you're gonna see how that happens many are asking me about wall breakers you gotta know that wall breakers are not going for a wall they're always going for a building for a building which is closed inside a wall so on this one you will notice that he's taking out all of those buildings and once he's gonna drop the wall breakers they're not gonna go exactly where you think they're gonna go so right now notice that the wall breakers were released and as I said they're gonna go to the closest buildings that is that is closed inside a wall so from this direction the closest building which is closed is this Wiz Tower and this is the reason they're gonna go to this wall and not to this wall because this building is more far from the wall breakers release point if you would release your wall breakers over here they're definitely going to break this wall but since the Wiz Tower is closer this is the reason it doesn't happen so this is something that you gotta remember when you're using wall breakers and now you we're gonna see more wall breakers so notice right now there are no more buildings over here so no reason for the for the wall breakers to break the wall over here also this arch tower is not closed inside the wall because there's an entrance over here that you broke before so the closest buildings from this direction is gonna be this air defense and this is exactly the reason why, why the wall breakers are gonna go directly to this wall if you would drop your wall breakers right here they're gonna go for this gold storage and gonna break the wall somewhere here so this is something very very important and many people don't know that they don't know how the wall breakers are working and they're trying to break walls and suddenly the wall breakers are going directly to some other path and they're failing their attacks so hopefully this this guy this small guy is gonna help you knowing where the wall breakers are gonna go in many of the cases you can you can plan that ahead but even if you didn't plan plan that ahead just look for a second where's the closest building and then you will know how to release the wall breakers just like any other defense just like any other troop not defense of course so on this one all the lava hounds are already dropped together with the balloons he didn't use the queen ability and this base is definitely going to be destroyed by this awesome attack we got mismatched again in this war but this time we managed winning this one especially thanks to that i mean not especially we would win without this attack as well but this one was very very important in the early stage of the war because we had 
only one Town Hall 10 and they had a Town Hall 11, so if they would clean all the Town Hall 9s, it would depend on percentage only, but they didn't clean all Town Hall 9s eventually, and this is the reason we won. So hope you like it, if you did like, subscribe and comment, and of course tell your clan mates about the channel, bring them here, and they are gonna learn how to 3 star as well, so we'll see each other in the next video, bye bye.